Hi, all APC 2020 chemistry aspirants. I hope all of you done well. So here in this video, we are going to analyze each and every question of chemistry paper two, and this is the part two of it. So watch the video completely to get the best conceptual analysis. And here I will try in Telugu words too for you people of AP and uh, Telangana. In the mass bore spectroscopy, the isomeric shift values of the halides follow the order. And uh, here, Mark tells in the intent from fluorine to iodine, the electronegativity decreases. Okay, right. And uh, when you look at mass bore principle, NT, the tin metal pina the s electron density okay so the s electron density uh, if it is increased then the chemical shift value also increases i think you for example fluorine tin metal tone connect time then kondi apadayment the fluorine is a strong electronegative atom right so that's why electron density drags towards it and the s electron density decrease out in the apadayte fluorine tone Tin sigma bond ni form jeshna padu. Alage ikkada manaki chlorine and uh, here uh, bromine and here iodine. So iodine achche sari ki the electronegativity chala takko ka batti the s electron density uh, tin pina perugu thundi ka batti when we compared with the tin fluorine compounds tin iodine compounds yukka chemical shifts values ane vi ekko ga untai. So it, what is the correct answer? Uh, correct order here. Option D. From tin fluoride compounds to tin iodide compound, the isomeric shift values increases in mass bar spectra that is due to increasing S electron density on the tin metal. Okay, right. And uh, uh, next question should be. The HNMR spectrum of Netophi C5H5 rhodium uh, C2H4 taken twice at minus 20 degrees centigrade shows a typical A A prime and X X prime pattern in the olefinic region. So the most important thing in today, which one the questions question ni correct understand chase code. Okay. So on increasing the temperature to approximately 70 degrees centigrade, the separate lines collapse into single line, which is due to. So try to ikadaman chayal sin the nante uh sorry e rhodium complex complex ni uh then you could geometry ni draw chodan ki try chali, okay. So, CP is neat of 5, which is connected with uh, its 5 electrons of the ring. Okay, right. And two uh, alkenes can uh, interact through its uh, pi electrons. Okay, right. And uh, two ethylene yoka 4 hydrogens. Okay, so just think that these 4 hydrogens are back side of the plane. And these four hydrogens are above the plane. That means we ila what you can the what you ka, what we say simply perpendicular to the plane ki. Right? So Dani Valla they experience different chemical environment. So Dani Valla Mouthundi and at minus twenty degrees centigrade the gara e volifins and we freeze out. Hai. They cannot rotate freely, okay, through their double bonds. So Dani Valla they will show uh, NMR peaks. But the temperature 70 degrees ki pench taro apudu e olefins and heavy free ga rotate out and the hydrogens and heavy free ga rotate out they cannot be uh, what we say they cannot be distinguished. They will be considered as same uh, in same in chemical environment. Okay, same chemical environment. That's why they will show only one single line. Okay, so option A is the correct answer. Free rotation of the ethylene ligand takes place about the metal olefin bond whenever temperature is increased from minus 20 degrees centigrade to approximately 70 degrees centigrade. Got it? Yeah, in go, uh, next question, Jodham. I in IR spectrum, so here, here cobalt complex. So for that image, cobalt hydrogen stretch is ab absorbed at 1840. The COD that is a deuterated cobalt complex, it should do that. You can stretch and then it got okay, right? It could have a month, 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 month,
యొక్క రిలేషన్ విత్ రెడ్యూజ్డ్ మాస్ ఇక్కడ ఫ్రీక్వెన్సీ అనేది ఇన్వర్స్ ఇన్వర్స్లీ రిలేటెడ్ విత్ రెడ్యూజ్డ్ మాస్ ఓకే సో ఈ కాన్సెప్ట్ నుంచి మనం ఆన్సర్ చేస్తాం ఎలా అంటే చూడండి న్యూ సివోడి బై న్యూ సివోహెచ్ సో వాచ్ ద వీడియో కంప్లీట్లీ వీడియో కంప్లీట్గా చూడండి టు గెట్ ద బెస్ట్ కాన్సెప్ట్స్ ఫర్ అనలైసిస్ నా మ్యూ దట్ ఈస్ అ రెడ్యూజ్డ్ మాస్ ఆఫ్ సివోహెచ్ బై రెడ్యూజ్డ్ మాస్ ఆఫ్ సివోడి okay now for this coh what is the reduced mass you can simply take 60 into 1 by 61 under root uh, 16 into 1 by 61 by 60 into 2 by 62 endukante hydrogen yokka mass enta 1 cobalt yokka mass enta 60 so deuterium yokka mass enta 2 so from that we can get under root 1 by 2 now by ju just substitute 1 by 2 here then from that you can get new COD equals to new COH into 1 by under root 2. So frequency of COH and the charges 1840 just substitute here 40 into 1 by under root 2. So from that you will get approximately 1304. Okay here 1300. So option B is the correct answer. Got it. Yeah the next question. మ్యాచ్ లిస్ట్ వన్ కంపౌండ్స్ విత్ లిస్ట్ టూ హియర్ ఎఫ్ నైన్టీన్ అనే మార్ని మనం చూడాలి ఎస్ ఎఫ్ ఫోర్ ఇక్కడ ఎలక్ట్రాన్ జామెట్రీని డ్రా చేయడానికి ట్రై చేయండి సో టూ ఫ్లోరిన్స్ అనేవి యాక్సియల్ ఫ్లోరిన్స్ అండ్ అదర్ టూ ఫ్లోరిన్స్ ఆర్ ఈక్వటోరియల్ ఫ్లోరిన్స్ ఓకే సో ఇప్పుడు ఎప్పుడైతే మనం యాక్సియల్ ఫ్లోరిన్స్ని కన్సిడర్ చేసినప్పుడు దే విల్ ఎక్స్పీరియన్స్ కెమికల్ ఎన్విరాన్మెంట్ డిఫరెంట్ కెమికల్ ఎన్విరాన్మెంట్ ఆఫ్ టూ ఈక్వటోరియల్ ఫ్లోరిన్స్ కదా ఎప్పుడైతే మనం ఈక్వటోరియల్ ఫ్లోరిన్స్ ని కన్సిడర్ చేసినప్పుడు ఈ టూ యాక్సియల్ ఫ్లోరిన్స్ యొక్క కెమికల్ ఎన్విరాన్మెంట్ ని అవి ఎక్స్పీరియన్స్ చేస్తాయి సో దానివల్ల వాట్ వి సే టూ ట్రిప్లెట్స్ విత్ రెస్పెక్ట్ టు యాక్సియల్ ఫ్లోరిన్స్ వన్ ట్రిప్లెట్ విత్ రెస్పెక్ట్ టు ఈక్వటోరియల్ ఫ్లోరిన్స్ వన్ ట్రిప్లెట్ సో టోటల్ టూ టూ ట్రిప్లెట్స్ కెన్ బి అబ్జర్వ్ సో వన్ మ్యాచెస్ విత్ ఫోర్ సో ఆప్షన్ మస్ట్ బి బిట్వీన్ ఏ అండ్ డి ఓన్లీ నా హెచ్పిఎఫ్ టూ సో హెచ్పిఎఫ్ టూలో ఎప్పుడ ఇక్కడ చూడండి వాట్ ఈస్ గోయింగ్ టు గివ్ సో డబ్లెట్ ఆఫ్ డబ్లెట్ సింప్లీ డబ్లెట్ ఆఫ్ డబ్లెట్ హౌ కెన్ యూ గెట్ దట్ డబ్లెట్ ఆఫ్ డబ్లెట్ సో హియర్ యూ కెన్ జస్ట్ టేక్ ఇట్ ద కప్లింగ్ ఆఫ్ EFP should be considered first when we compared uh, with the coupling of EFH. Okay, right now EFP. So here only one pass plus is there. That's why it will give one doublet. Now we need to look at the FH. One hydrogen is there. That's why here another doublet. So total here what we say doublet of doublet. So here doublet of doublet. Now IF5. what is the geometry of if5 simply square pyramidal right square pyramidal geometry that's why it is going to give fintet and pf3 now uh, so pf3 is also pyramidal in shape right so the geometry is very very important to decide the chemical environment okay chemical environment telusukovali ante manam geometry manaku telusundali so from the geometry we can say that it is uh, it is going to give quartet okay right and uh, next question for uh, atomic hydrogen the resonance is observed at a magnetic field uh, uh, b is equal to 0.34 tesla what is the g value for the electron in the hydrogen atom if the operating frequency of the instrument is 9.5 gigahertz bohr magneton is given so we need to find the g value so g value is uh, uh, absolutely two here so option a is the correct answer for it and how to cal calculate okay we have the equation equation into g equals to h nu by mu 0 into b 0 here h into planck's constant nu into frequency here frequency into chero 9.5 giga hedges manam danni hedges loki convert cheskovali so it should be multiplied with 10 power 9 okay so 9.5 into 10 power 9 hedges okay now planck's constant into frequency by mu 0 what is mu 0 bohr magneton so bohr magneton value is given 9.274 in 10 power minus 24 joule for tesla and b 0 magnetic frequency uh, magnetic field strength sorry so b value 0.34 tesla just substitute all the values and uh, we will get the answer 2.0003 so option a is the correct answer okay right 
Now, which of the following element can be used as ionization suppressor? Oksari, it's an option Sunday children did in low CCM belongs to alkali metal. So, alkali metals or uh, used as the best ionization suppressors. So, option A is the correct answer. In the case, alkali metals are easy to ionize, but they can be used as ionization suppressors. Okay, right. Next question. Now, separation of simple ions, monovalent cations, on a strongly acidic exchanger follows this order. So, each and twenty order correct order. So, reason lithium plus is the most strongly held on the resin. This is the correct statement, but this reason is not the correct assertion. This is the correct assertion. This is the correct assertion. Just it is strongly held on the resin and the correct assertion. What is the correct assertion? Both A and R are the true, but R is not the correct explanation. So, option B is the correct answer. Okay, right. And next one. Match list 1 with list 2 and choose the correct answer for the codes. Now, cytochrome C. So, cytochrome C low, unde de ente, cytochrome C low simple ga iron tunde, and uh, clamodulin low unde de ente, calcium, and chlorophyll low, magnesium, and alcohol dehydrogenase low unde de zinc. Okay, so it got a bioinorganic. So, I have a CSIR syllabus, I have a lot of questions in CSIR, previous year papers, I have a lot of copy paste in CSIR. Some of you have a lot of questions. Now, in photosynthetic systems, the redox metal proteins involved in electron transfer or cytochrome C, cytochrome B, this is also a copy paste question from CSIR. Uh, previous year question okay so the correct order intent is cytochrome b2 cytochrome bf and plastocyanin so option c is the correct answer now so from the uh, following reactions coenzyme b2 will promoted with so coenzyme b2 will pina good say sir question undi ikkada idi the correct uh, promoted reactions or diol dehydrase reaction conversion of ribonucleotide to deoxyribonucleotide and one one comma two carbon shift in organic substrates but not the epoxidation of alkenes it e coenzyme and alkenes yoke epoxidation low involved in the but not alkenes so two three four are the correct ones okay right and next one what is not uh, true about uh, feridaxins so feridaxin involved in acceleration of ammonia uh, the correct and generate h2 from acidic solution and it is iron sulfur protein but the reduction potential for feridaxins will be in negative values but it can make it 0 to 0 0.5 which are but we can expect option c is the correct answer okay so number of metal uh metal metal bonds in uh, bonds of the given uh, uh, dimer or dimeric complexes. So, molybdenum complex is given. Molybdenum belongs to chromium. Kabati 6 valency electrons. So, 2 are there. 6 into 2, 12 plus 6, uh, OR. So, R in the place of R, we may think it is alkyl group. That means methaxy or alkaxy group is there. In which, so the alkaxy group can uh, coordinate with that molybdenum through only one electron. Kabati, manaman ko choose 6. Um, alkoxy groups uh, contribute six electrons so total of uh, 18 electrons only now we can use the uh, equation that is total electron count equals to 18 x minus 2 y here x and t number of metals so only two metals are there now so from that uh, we can we can take y equals to number of metals okay so 2y equals to 36 minus 18 and y is equal to 18 by 2 it should be 9 but it's absolutely wrong and uh, uh, choose it must be 4 uh, in the case of an in normal case of molybdenum complexes but uh, it is showing 9 so you may get answer for um, marks for this question because options are given wrong here it cannot show more than 5 okay so till now experimental observation 20 metal metal bonds only 5 okay the highest metal metal bonds are only five so six is not possible and four is possible for that but the, uh, but the given equation is not going to give the correct number of metal metal bonds okay right thank you very much and uh, next video is slow shoot them uh, me in questions nick complete again let's share them and if you are interested you can visit and join chemmasters.online website for the best online courses uh, on chemistry 
It, and uh, you can also practice very high standard online test series to boost your success rate in various chemistry examinations. Thank you very much.